smoking gas, I feel like I cute. Oh, feel like I cute. Bitch, I'm smoking gas, I feel like I cute. I feel like I cute. Bitch, I'm smoking gas, I feel like I cute. Yeah, I feel like I cute. Bitch, I'm smoking gas, I feel like I cute. Yeah, I feel like I cute. I'm sipping that red solo like I cute. Yeah, I got all these bitches. On where do we start? Where do we start? So where do we start? Okay, so cool. This is this is ancient history, by the way. Um, so this is years and this is over ten years old. This is this is super old. It ain't super old, but it's old. I was in a different stage of my life. Like I wasn't the young bossed up. Young OG nigga I am now, you know? I was just a young, young punk. God damn it, just running around knocking niggas in their head. And I'm joking. I was always a hustler though. But, so, me and my homie, right? Me and my homie, I, I'm not going to say his name, but me and my homie, I had to patch up this backwood. Me and my homie, we both got the same birthday. Well, not the same birthday, but we the same sign. And our birthday is not too far apart. So I randomly hit up the homie one night, or he hit me up, I can't remember. Let's call the homie. Let's call the homie Tom. So I hit up Tom. I'm like, hey Tom, what's the deal? Or he hit me up. Somehow we got on the phone. We talk, we homies, so we talk. He like, I'm like, nigga, what you doing, nigga? It's actually the homie Tom birthday. My birthday is in like two weeks, but we, you know, we the same sign and we like, we really good friends. So we celebrate our shit together. Whether it's, you know, however it go. We gonna, yeah, his birthday is like my birthday. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. So I'm like, what's the word? We like, well, we, we, we getting it together. We he said, man, I got these two little broads, you know, um, such and such and such and such. I'm like, who the fuck is that? He like, show the girl that be at the studio or the show that you met that one time. I said, oh, that joke. Well, she won't really like my style style. You know what I'm saying? But it was the homie birthday. I, it was, I was bored. It was nighttime. You know, niggas, you know, shit turn up at night. You know, the freaks come out at night. The, the gutter niggas come out at night, you know? So, I'm like, where they at? He like, they at the hotel up here. A hotel that was close to our uh, our community like a local hotel you did you know the ones the ones that did were actually this is more of a motel because it wasn't you know the rooms outside you know what i'm saying but it was a nice size motel it wasn't it wasn't too trapped out you know what i'm saying um but it, yeah it was it used probably used to be something else a holiday inn or days inn or red roof or something like that right the indians then bought it shut out my indian folk islamic you know my not indian like you know what I mean? Middle Eastern. Because that's who owned you here. Uh, so I'm like, bet, man, I'm finna get dressed. Where you wanna meet you at? He's like, meet me at the stove. The stove is like, if this is the fucking, the, um, the spot, the, the, the motel, hotel, the store is directly across the street. I probably can stand in front of that motherfucker and throw a football. You know what I'm saying? So, I get dressed. I'll never forget what I had on. I had a white t-shirt. I had some tropical, there was mostly white. I had a white t-shirt, some white tropical Speedo shorts, like swimming sweet. I be, I be wearing swimming trunks. That's kind of like a thing that I always did. I just was like, I'm on some like Jay-Z in 1996 shit. Nigga, we wearing swimming trunks. I'm just on some dope boy fresh, like. I'm just on some shit with the white, with the white Air Forces or whatever, you know what I'm saying? So I, I threw, the, I threw the, the white Speedo swimming trunks on, but they had like red, they had flowers on them, tropical. You know how swimming trunks be red, blue, yellow. They was all kind of mixed in. It wasn't too much. It was just like, but so then I threw my yellow and black Kobe's on, rest in peace to Black Mamba. I had the actual first Black Mamba Kobe's, the Nike, when he first got with Nike, with the scrap. It was all black with a little yellow trim around them, kind of like mid top. Kind of like the length of uh, Air Jordan 1s, like how high those is. The regular Air Jordan 1s, not the low tops or the, you know, the mid to nothing. So I'm feeling fresh in the bitch, you know what I'm saying? Throw my, throw my, I had a, um, a Pittsburgh Pirates hat, throw my P hat on. Um, I'm like, fuck it, meet the bro, right? I'm like, nigga, I'm like, let's go on here and get some blunts. Let's get some shit out of the store. Boom, boom, boom. 
I'm like, they there? He's like, yeah, they over there. I'm like, so we just walked from the store to the motherfucking hotel, right? So he, he on the phone, I'm, yeah, yeah, I want, it's me and my nigga Q. Is it good if I bring him? Who is that? The nigga with the braids, the nigga that rap, he from Virginia. The brown skin dude with the braids, he got the hair. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, he funny, he cool, he cool, he cool people. Tell him, yeah, he good. So it's two broads, right? So it's me and my nigga, you know what I'm saying? So you know we on, you gonna get one. So at, on the way there, me and bro, we talking. Matter of fact, I tell him, I say, nigga, it's your birthday. I think his birthday was either like the day before or hours before, or he, it just turned his birthday like 12 or something. I said, nigga, it's your birthday, nigga. I said, I'm, you were the real player right now. I said, this is what the fuck we gonna do. We gonna have a memorable one. Well, you is, but I'm gonna be, you know, we, we here, nigga. We together, nigga. I said, because we, I'm gonna be honest. We already knew, well, he is hipping me to it. I didn't know, because I ain't really know them. I only met the chick, well, one of the chicks one time. I didn't meet the other chick until I got there. She was, that was the other girlfriend. But I knew she was like a freak, right? To say the least. She, I don't think she was fucking everybody. She's a freak, though. She like certain type niggas, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm So I'm already knowing what type of vibe it is. She get fucked up. She smoke weed. She drank. She, you know, we on that same type of time. All us. So I tell her, bro, I said, bro, this is what we're going to do. I said, when we go in there, I said, we're going to kick it, kick it, kick it. You know, parlay, do our thing. We ain't got to even think about it. We just going to be kicking it. I said, but when it come down to some pussy, you going to be hitting one at first. I'm going to be hitting the other one. Whichever ones we get, we get. Whoever get, whichever one first get. You know what I'm saying? Now, keep in mind, this is a hotel room. Two beds and a little bathroom. It's a regular little trap room, basically. I said, but, bro, you going to hit your joint over there? You hit your joint on one bed, I'm going to hit my joint on one bed. But we got to hit them from the back so we can we can look at each other. No homo. You know, we, got, we, we still had our shirts on, right? Niggas was wearing long tees then. This one niggas was wearing long tees. So that give you an idea how long ago this was. Niggas was wearing 4X, 5X tees, right? So I said, bro, we're going we gonna to have to stay in tune because we got to make this one for the books. I said, we're going to be... And why they heads is both down or they ain't looking? Because you know how girls be. They, they halfway don't be... Unless they probably looking back at you or they looking like, nigga, what is you doing? But if you really giving them that drill, drill, that... This the... This the uh, if you mean them... If you... If you beating them or you, you oh man, that shit hurt my hand. That's how hard you gotta beat them though. <laughs> I said, look, I'm gonna do the signal. Cause I, this is actually this is something that a nigga had did did before. So I was telling him, like, yo, I'm gonna do some shit. We about to turn up, nigga. We gonna we gonna you you about to boss up tonight. I said, I'm gonna give you the signal. And when I give you the signal, when both of their heads down and they we killing them. And you, you can see me, I can see you. While they, they looking down on the bed, I'm going to give you the signal. We're going to do the switcheroo. And without saying anything, we're going to instantly, ah, out of each one of them. And we and we had the magnums on that. Don't get, we're not raw dogging them bitches. We're not raw dogging Especially not, come on, don't have a raw dog no bitch like that anyway. Um, so I said, nigga, we're going to rock around. We're going to switch up. And you're going to have the one I had, and I'm going to have the one you had. And I bet you they cool with it. I said, nigga, it's your birthday, nigga. I bet you, nigga. You that nigga, man. We them niggas, right? <laughs> Even though I, had, I was pretty confident it was going to happen like that because I already know, you know what I mean, what I'm capable of. I all the way didn't know. But boy, let me tell your ass what the fuck happened next. So, Camera, music, camera. I did my time just like a man. I came home, stuck to the plan. No more probation. You understand? No more probation. You understand? I did my time, yeah. Just like a man, yeah. I came home, yeah. Stuck to the plan, yeah. No more probation, yeah. You understand? Yeah. No more probation, yeah. You understand?